Just gonna look for the updates here. Okay, so everything's all loaded up. It got the you know the latest update and the newest version here. And what SEO Spyglass is gonna do is it's gonna give you a great kind of inside look as to uh, what your competition's uh, linking strategy is, where they're linking, and a bunch of other useful information. Uh, so what I'm gonna do here is let's see, let's do. Let's do make money online if, as far as a keyword. Now at this point, I could hit next, or I could enter a uh, competitor's URL to analyze. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's do our own blog here. Uh, we don't do a whole lot of... Uh, of SEO on that blog, but we'll take a look at her anyway. I could show expert options on the next screen. Okay, so you have the choice of looking in all of these different search engines, or you can even add more search engines. So, um, you know, there's not, not really a limit to what you can do here. Uh, the reason that the check mark is in Yahoo is because as you may or may not know it's just a lot easier to extract data as far as where backlinks are and things like that from Yahoo uh, but if you wanted to you could use Google or any other search engine I'm gonna go ahead and hit uh, next uh, one other thing I'll point out if there's a search engine that you want to use that isn't in there uh, you can add it here go ahead and hit next unlimited number of backlinks to find limit the number of backlinks to find so let's just limit it to let's say 50 per search engine per project uh, exclude duplicates so let's see what it comes up with I'm just gonna limit it to 50 just so we don't have to uh, win any any large amount of time to actually see the data that it pulls so in about three seconds uh, to analyze 52 backlinks uh, view logs we'll see what that looks like here that'll tell you exactly you know what the software did uh, let's go back to finish and then what this is going to tell us is it says now you can collect various backlink factors that help you better analyze your competitors linking strategy and determine the quality of each link would you like to update your project for backlink factors now so I can you know hit yes and go back in and find out things like uh, the anchor URL what the anchor text was uh, the PR or page rank of the page how many external links uh, are on the page, total number of links, uh, and a bunch of other information over here. So let's just go back, click yes, and let's, um, now let's just leave everything there, okay? So there's a whole bunch of stuff here, pretty much anything that you would ever wanna know in order to analyze either, you know, a backlink or somebody's linking strategy is included here. I'm gonna go ahead and hit next, and it's gonna do its thing. We're at 10 percent, 11 percent. It should take uh, just about probably uh, two, two and a half, three minutes here. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and pause the video and uh, open it back up when everything's done, and then we can take a look at what type of information it actually pulled back. Okay, so congratulations, search, search engine data has been updated successfully, and the total time elapsed there was about 46 seconds. It says. I, th I thought it was about a minute and a half or so, two minutes, but maybe it was uh, less. I didn't really pay attention while it was going. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and hit finish. And then here is all the information. Okay, so this tells us the PR of the uh, of where the backlink is. So it looks like I commented here on uh, Andrew Hansen's blog. And anchor text was Jeremy Kelsall. Uh, the anchor URL blog.donandjeremy.com PR3 uh, total of 62 external links on that page with a total links of 235 um, and if you look all the way down here you can see that information on everything so for each and every single backlink uh, you can see you know the title 
uh, links back, anchor text, anchor URL, the PR of the page, external links, total links, uh, link value, uh, the you know kind of base domain, the IP of the domain, so you can see what kind of IP diversity that there is there, uh, the domain, the domain PR, uh, which over here you have the page PR, so the page rank of the actual page where the backlink is located, uh, and over here the domain PR. Uh, is you know actual the actual base uh, domain page rank uh, whether or not it's listed in DMOS whether or not it's listed in the Yahoo directory uh, the Alexa link the domain age and I mean that like I said that's pretty much just about anything that you would ever want to know about a backlink or a backlinking profile uh, and gives you more than enough information to pretty much pick apart any type of backlinking or SEO strategy uh, that any of your competitors uh, could possibly have going on. Um, so, I mean, all in all, it's a it's a killer set of tools. Um, you know, even here, you can go back in, you can do a report, and it'll kind of walk you through everything. Um, you know, it, it's a it's a killer set of tools. Uh, there are other tools out there that are advertised to do kind of the same tasks, and trust me, I've tried just about all of them. None of them none that I found you know if you know of any feel free to let me know and I'm more than happy to try them out uh, but so far none of them that I found have even come close to working uh, the way that this set of tools does um, you know if you if you ask around you won't find anybody that has a bad word to say about them uh, this video isn't because uh, I have an affiliate link because I don't I may turn into an affiliate later on uh, but as of right now, I'm not an affiliate and don't have a, any type of uh, immediate plans to be an affiliate. So, you know, I don't make a dime or have anything to gain whatsoever here uh, by letting you know about this stuff. Uh, just kind of wanted to put this set of tools out there because I know it's not on a lot of people's radar probably. Uh, because it's not really advertised in the same circles that a lot of us run as far as forums and that type of stuff. Uh, but it's definitely a set of tools that you should look at. Uh, especially if you plan on kind of being a, a staple in the industry. If you're going to be around for, you know, a year, two years, 10 years, 20 years, uh, this is a, a tool set, uh, a set of tools here that will more than earn you back what your investment is, either in reports that you can generate for clients or kind of intelligence and data that you can kind of gather and, and use uh, in your own strategies uh, against your competitors. So definitely something that you, sh that you should check out. Um, Linkassistant.com is where uh, where you can go to read more about this stuff. Uh, again, great set of tools. Can't recommend it high enough. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to let us know. Uh, but this definitely gets a you know a big two thumbs up from uh, both Don and I. Um, so there you have it.